what's up guys so I wanted to do a weekly update on a small account challenge and basically the moves I've made lately right now I'm hiking in Pennsylvania and it's almost 50 degrees really nice perfect weather it's not too hot yet so I want to get out in nature and enjoy this weather right now I'm gonna show you a couple video clips here in a second I'm just let you see what I'm seeing it's really nice um, it's only 30 minutes from home pretty much but I wanted to do a weekly update on a small account challenge so I've deposited another hundred this Friday so that's two hundred dollars invested into this account I did buy the gold miners initially I let everyone know I was gonna do that and I exited even with my bigger account my main account I exited leaps that had on gold and I'm going to show that here in a screenshot as far as why. There was large selling volume on a daily candle that broke out on uh, the bull flag I was saying about. You don't want to see that. So we could end up consolidating for days, weeks, months at this point. I don't really know. But so far it looks like the exit was a really good move because we had further downside and that's what I was expressing. So we can see more downside and also at the same time we have opportunity costs i'm trying to grow the account so i don't want to sit through long periods of consolidation not right now with a bull flag breakout like that you don't want to see them selling into it right away we had bearish divergence that i'm going to show here right now and i think this is going to play out for an extended period of time it might be weeks so i'm not willing to sit through that I said the goal is to grow the account. The good thing about being a day trader is being able to recognize these warning signs and avoid them. Avoid long-term periods where I'm not making any money on this account. Like I'm bullish gold long-term, sure. It'll probably go up long-term. But like I said, there's opportunity costs. So I could end up sitting there for weeks not making any money. It's a lot smarter for me to take that money out, even sit in cash cash it's a position and that's what I'm gonna do the other hundred I deposited in that's just sitting cash right now I decided I was gonna buy BITO which is a Bitcoin ETF and my trade plan on Bitcoin is this is at one of my buy zones one of three and I'm willing to buy here if we retrace more I'm willing to buy more at a certain zone so I have a trade plan set up for this accordingly and I think Bitcoin's going to hit a new all-time high. It always has after the halving. That doesn't mean it has to. But I believe it probably will. It has more um, institutional money behind it now with ETFs. So I think it's more probable that it'll actually happen. I'm looking for maybe 150 a coin. So it's a good double from here. And like I said, half the account is in cash. The other half is in that for right now. And I'll deposit another 100 this Friday. Not sure what I'm gonna do. Like I said, cash is a position. It's always good to have dry powder and just wait for that next move because if you don't know what opportunity is gonna arise, there is something I'm eyeing up right now, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna buy it. I'm debating it. I might have to sit through weeks or months of red, but I think it'll be well worth it in the next couple years. So um, I'll disclose that at a later date. As far as following this uh, small account challenge, I would highly recommend joining that free Discord. Link's in the description below. I said it's free for right now. It's not always gonna be free. Take advantage of this. I'm sharing technical analysis. You're learning as I grow to this account. So the least you could do is educate yourself. You don't have to take the trades. Um, I don't expect anyone to. I'm trying to do this to show you how I would do it. If you follow the trades, it's at your own risk. Um, you can do so. I believe they're really good long-term. And honestly, it's sort of a challenge myself because I'm very short-term minded. I go in and out a couple minutes, a couple days, a week is long for me. I like the quick moves, make a lot of money and move on. But doing this, there's a lot less stress, risk. Um, this is exactly how you would start out. And that's why I'm doing this. I wanna show people this is how I would start as a brand new trader. And I'm trying to educate people and show them how I would do it. And in the next step, I'll show you how to trade 
options. We're gonna start selling options. So it's all catered to how you would start and I wanna expedite your learning curve. So take advantage of it. Like I said, it's free. It's not always gonna be free. My plan is in the future is to charge a small amount of money that pays my monthly expenses. And then I never pull from the market ever. And I think it's well worth it. The value I offer is pretty good. I paid people a lot of money to know what I know. So take advantage of it. I'm not always right. Nobody is. You'll not find a single trader that's right every time. The best traders are ones that are able to be humble and admit that. And admit that they were wrong, take the loss, move on. Right now I'll share the uh, account value. It's not up a lot, it's only one weekend. So I'm gonna update this every week. On the weekends, I'll share my thoughts, kind of what I'm doing with the account and where it actually is. So, so right now it's showing on Robinhood that it's almost up 1%. It's actually up almost 2%. So I just deposited hundred bucks. So technically it's almost up 2%. It's not a lot, it's a couple dollars. I was up 4% at one point on the gold miners, but here's the thing. Compounding interest, the way it works, over the long term, I'm gonna show you something right now, and this is all hypotheticals, but over the long term, if you keep depositing 100 bucks, say in five years, right? I'm gonna show this chart right now, five years, it'll be like 24 grand, I think it is, invested. But if I compound this, and my target, like I said, was a double up, which is aggressive. If I get 50%, which is halfway to my target each year, the account would be over 100 grand within five years. And I would have put in $24,000. So you're slowly growing your wealth. I mean, that's fast, but you're growing your wealth over the long term. And then you're going to grow even faster with that money you have because it's exponential growth. If you look here, one more year goes takes the account another almost $70,000. It's huge. So... You want time. The longer you do this, the faster you can grow. As far as dollar signs, your percentage growth comparison to your investment is huge. Take advantage of this. Start today, whether that's just learning. I highly encourage to learn about the markets. It's massive. Compounding interest can change your life. And that can change your life in more ways than just the market. Real estate, there's other things you can do. Your own business. I, for one, like to encourage people to do things on their own because, yeah, there's greater risk, but the reward is much better. Complacency is a killer. Push yourself to do something a little more. Um, like I said, the link's in the description below as far as the Discord. It's completely free for right now. I'm not sure when it's going to cost money, but at some point it's going to. My time is valuable. And I'm not just going to suck away my life teaching people. I really want to teach people. I love it. I love talking about the markets, but at the same time, like I said, I quit my job to have free time. So I'm not going to suck away my whole life teaching people right now. I will do it, but if it starts becoming overwhelming, there's going to be a small fee. Like I said, I paid 150 a month for a Discord, a couple of them actually. I learned from a lot of people. Um, my plan is to charge a dollar a day, so $30 a month. Once I feel like this is too much, and even then there's gonna be a cap on my time because you only have so much time. It's your most valuable asset you have in life is your time and no one's promised tomorrow. So I'm gonna live my life at the same time, you know what I mean? But my passion is to actually help people. So take advantage of it. Discord links in the description below. Join today. You'll see my entries, exits, my thought processes, my day trades right now, obviously everything's in there. And ask me questions, ask me anything. Ask me about my trading setup, the computer, what it's, what the, what the parts are, anything at all. I'm here to help you. I want you to succeed in life in general. Like I said, the link's in the description below. So check it out, join today, and I hope to see you in there.